the people who've written in to us and the people we met on the street who've said congratulations and wish us all the best. We'd like to take this opportunity of thanking those people. Yeah. Right, and what would you like to say? Just the same, thanks for all your support and well wishes and really nice letters. Really appreciate it. Thank you. research has shown that uh, one bag is actually used for 15 minutes and it actually takes 500 years to degrade in the environment. I'd be a bit more conscious about bringing my own, I suppose, yeah. yeah. But I would buy them if I need them, obviously. Do you think it's a good idea? I do. I think it's a good enough thing, yeah. Uh, well, the litter and stuff. I've been saving up a load of plastic bags for the last few months. The house is jammers with plastic bags. Yeah. Aircom and Irish soccer go further. The training pitch is a disgrace. And somebody's got to somebody's got to hold a hand up and say it's like training on a car park. Bloody rock cars. We've had one or two injuries already, and I expect a few more. And, uh, that's my opinion. I'm entitled to my opinion. Now, um, I just said all I want is best, and if that's a crime, well then I'm guilty. Chill out. What she yelling for? Lay back. It's all been done before And if you could only let it be You would see I like you the way you are When we're driving in your car And you're talking to me Can you give us an, any insight into what happened last night? No Can you even tell us how you're feeling at the moment? I feel uh, very good Clear conscience and I'm happy to be going home. If I felt for one second, for one second, I was a little bit out of order, I'd apologise and I'd go back and I'd love to play in the World Cup. But, but I'm 100% right. I know I am. It has been dealt with, and it's not going to change now. And I'd like to think that you're going to support the 22 players. Whether you support me or not, irrelevant at this stage. Get behind them, guys. Take off all your preppy clothes. You know you're not fooling anyone when you become someone. Joe against Staunton.
not the Republic of Mick McCarthy. No. It's not the Republic of Roy Keane either. And what's a little bit sad is that one of the best players in the world didn't play in the World Cup. That's for sure. And for whatever reasons that was, yeah. But what's also a little bit sad is that the set of circumstances affected a guy who's done his best for Ireland always as a player and as a manager, and that's me. And it's a little bit sad that all those circumstances have affected that. But we get on with it. Onwards and upwards, mate. They will break, stars will fall. There's always something you'll forget to say. Don't dismay. True friends never part. Sometimes there's a moment that can test a friendship or a situation, and we appear to have reached such a moment. But I would certainly wish that none of this had happened. It hasn't been good for Roy, it hasn't been good for Irish soccer, it hasn't been good for me personally, it hasn't been good for anybody really. We'll meet again, trust me my friend, there's no harm in goodbye. Give me your glass, follow your heart, wipe that tear from your eyes. Time makes amends, don't be afraid, you'll not let love pass you by. Remember this, true friends never part. on the blue team. People who are so miserable did nothing but moan, 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 bitch, bitch, bitch. level of negligence, to be honest with you. Disgrace, it is an attack on democracy, it is an attack on the vote for Sinn Féin. trying to pump oxygen into this field of flawed agreement must recognize that this agreement is over. who have managed to work out what the new signs mean and have followed the new orbital routes around the city like this one, the next sight they see are poles like these, where the signs haven't been erected yet. And where they go from there is anyone's guess. If you hate me, I will show 
Driving licence is very important for everybody in Ireland today. You really must have your licence. And if you're a persistent speeder and a persistent offender, you're going to lose that licence. Uh, I live a quarter of a mile from here uh, myself. I've uh, I've been the, the victim of watching the trucks uh, all, all, all my life going through this area and the, the huge environmental damage and harm it does. I'm delighted to see Dublin Port so busy. Um, so I think this is a great day. From today we can go to school again. Once again, we are free to further our knowledge and education and we are very happy about this. Would the region, the world, and not least the ordinary Iraqi people be better off without the regime of Saddam Hussein? The only answer anyone could give to that question would be yes. There's no single killer fact in this document which I was looking for, but what there is is a body of, of evidence that leads me to conclude that Saddam Hussein is uh, a threat militarily. The outcome of the current crisis is already determined. The full disarmament of weapons of mass destruction by Iraq will occur. In the three weeks ahead, I pledge my party, and I ask all parties, to give the people of Ireland the campaign they deserve. A campaign of substance, not slander. Of issues, not insults.
those aren't half of my chest. <laughs> You don't want something achieved by stealth. You don't want Fianna Fáil coming in under the public's radar screen and achieving an overall majority if voters themselves prefer coalition government. Very bad day for Fine Gael. It was beyond our expectations and beyond our worst fears. It's been a seriously bad election result for, for our party. You make me feel funny When you come around Yeah, that's what I found out, honey What am I do without you? you and when our time has come and the people go to vote the next time let them judge us on our performance and what we say we'll do, we will do. What am I do without you? I'm just delighted for the party and for all the people who supported us and our party workers. And, and the challenge now is just to, to try and do as good a job for the next five years. Thundering forward, looking for the opening score. I'm doing without you. Dean Coyle, I'm from Lark Holland Dairy. Um, did a birth of 15th of the 6th, 85, making me a Gemini. And um, what's it a birth that I say now? 15th of the same.
been travelling from six this morning. Yes, we love five. Yes, <laughs> To get to see Daniel getting married. He's worth it all. <laughs> it's the best day. The best day. And the fact that we can get married here is above and beyond everything. I feel wonderful, absolutely wonderful. Dream come true. Morning, absolutely. how are you? Thank you all. Magella, have you, you thought of all the hearts you've broken today? <laughs> sorry. <laughs> That's all I can say, I'm sorry. I'll look after Thank him, you. I promise. Just fantastic. I don't know why I'm this lucky. <laughs> bye bye. And stay with us here in RT1, Fair City is on the way.